The DevOps engineer salaries are ranging from 60 LPA to 1 CR plus in these companies. And in this video, I will be showing you the DevOps engineer salaries both in product based and the service based and the SRE engineer salaries in both product and service based. And you will be amazed to look at these salary breakdowns. Let me know in the comment section if any of the brackets I am telling is wrong, then I will delete this video. So this is my guarantee that all the statistics, whatever I am sharing with you is with real time. Those who have got placed in the recent times also the people those who have taken the one-to-one -one mentorship in getting them right path to judge which offer to select among their two to three offer letters so let's get started into the video so first of all i'll tell you the devops engineer salaries in 2025 with respect to the service based and product based companies now coming on to the service based companies these are the companies which don't have stocks which don't have major package in terms of bonus and they don't have much facilities in the companies. Service based companies are the companies like Infosys, TCS, Wipro, uh, TechM, HCL, Emphasis, Virtusa. These kind of companies offer low range packages to employees. So let's get started. Entry level in these kind of companies get around uh, 4 to 7 LPA. Entry level is here 0 to 2 years of experience. The mid level 3 to 6 years of experience are getting around 8 to 14 LPA. The senior level experience 7 to 12 years of experience are getting 15 to 25 LPA. At the same time, the architect or the lead with 12 plus years of experience are getting 25 to 35 LPA. Now, these are the salaries in the service based companies. Now, the DevOps engineer salaries in the product based companies when we are looking at them, uh, for example, in the product based companies, you get stocks, you get bonus, you get all the facilities, free phone, gym, health reimbursement, physical fitness reimbursement, whatnot, internet connection reimbursement and everything. And the companies like Microsoft, Google, Amazon, Adobe, Flipkart, etc. offers these kind of salary ranges in 2025. Entry level, anything around 0 to 2 years of experience get around 12 to 18 LPA. The mid level 0 to 3 years of experience, sorry, 3 to 6 years of of experience get around 20 to 25 to 35 LPA very great and senior level 7 to 12 years of experience get around 35 to 60 LPA and the architect level in the product based company as a DevOps architect gets around 60 to 80 plus LPA and it can touch around 1 CR plus with stock options. Now coming on to the SRE engineer salary is very very important. This salary is for the service based companies ranges a little bit high and you can compare between the DevOps and the SRE salaries. The service based company salaries uh, such as Infosys, TCS, Wipro, HCL, Accenture and Cognizance uh, goes with uh, uh uh, goes with entry level of 5 to 8 LPA, right? And mid level 3 to 6 years of experience, 10 to 16 LPA. Senior level 7 to 12 years, 18 to 28 LPA. At the same time, architect and lead level 12 plus years of experience get 28 to 40 LPA. So you can compare between the DevOps and SRE and which one is better. My suggestion, always keep in resume both the DevOps and the SRE titles and keep all the tools that are needed for you to get a job in 2025. Coming on to the upper class product based companies, let's say Google, Microsoft, Netflix, Uber, Flipkart. Again, uh, they have a little bit higher range, 15 to 22 LPA, 25 to 45 LPA, 45 to 70 LPA, 70 LPA to 1.2 CR as the stock options. Now coming on to the next things which are very, very much important is how to prepare you or yourself to sit in these kind of interviews. My strategy to hunt these kind of companies is always simple and I will tell you this strategy. I have majorly four job portals which I actually apply. For example, the first job portal is Nokri. The second job portal is LinkedIn. The third job portal is InstaHire. The fourth job portal is Indeed. When it comes to the Nokri job portal, I always make sure that Nokri is kind of a test match for us. You apply as many jobs as it comes on its way because in Nokri, the jobs that come into the picture are mostly low level uh, of companies that look for the candidate. So I make sure it's kind of a 
test match where you practice your skills to showcase to the interviews. If you are getting offer letter, well and good. If you are not getting offer letter, that's fine. You can rehearse again and give more interviews. The next platform is LinkedIn. This is the actual platform where you hunt for the product companies. All the product based companies post jobs on LinkedIn and you, you all know that how it has helped me to scale on a larger extent. So always make sure 20 to 30 jobs you apply on LinkedIn on a day to day basis and apply on their careers website also. Now the third platform is InstaHire. InstaHire is mostly for the companies like startups which pay very well but there is a danger in your uh, job right job safety will be less but definitely choose that platform also that has helped me to directly get the HR details HR names uh, with whom I used to search in the LinkedIn and connect with them so the fourth platform is indeed uh, it has helped me actually uh, indeed or monster or founded these platforms have helped me to look jobs outside of India and there are many many other job portals which you can look for the remote opportunities also. My strategy is very simple which I have already told you apply at least 50 to 60 jobs daily get 1% of the jobs calls onto your phone convert that 1% into the three interview calls and get one offer letter per week. It sounds really uh, very tough but if you practice this criteria you are going to get many good job offers and even you can practice and rehearse your interview patterns with different kinds of companies whenever you are failing in these kind of companies write down a notes or your notebook should be maintained like what went wrong why went wrong what you can do in the next interview better with this statistics I hope you have enjoyed the video like the video and comment down details and I'll be sharing you this document with you. Until then, take care and see you in the next video. This is Praveen signing off from this video. Bye.